Welcome back to Project Onboard. It's Ronald here, and we are kicking off. We're on the heat of it, by the looks of it. We're kicking off in March Ridge. So, last episode, we made a very, very risky trip down here. So, it kind of, uh, kind of worked out, I guess. We're alive. That's good enough for me. But it is starting to get crashy, which is not ideal. So, it kind of, uh, kind of scares me for the population. But, during the fire yesterday, saw this place. As you can see, every single window is boarded up. This place is a gold mine. Hopefully. It could also be a death sentence. But, yeah, what, what better time to discover that? Definitely should have brought a crowbar. On. There we go. Alright, we're coming in here at quite a bad time as well. We're pretty exhausted. Which is not ideal. So what I'm kind of hoping is I can either get some decent weapons and hightail out of there. Or, instead of going to the community centre, we can stumble across our famous generator mangan here. Which, yeah, would be the most ideal situation, really. I wonder what the difference between those is. Either way, we're taking it. Leave the other one behind. This one's slightly stronger. I might get some sleep as well. So the crash has sort of screwed things up, so our body clock is miles out. But yeah, not good. Unless I can just keep them running on vitamins all day. I suppose that could work too. At least for a few hours. Oh, nice. Yeah, I think that's got slightly more damage. Don't know why it's hoarded food up here, but I'm not going to say no. Got a fair bit on us as well. It's always good. Couple nightsticks. Okay, this place is already off to a wonderful start. <laughs> Trying to avoid heading out front for now. But that is also going to be a hell of an issue. If we get trapped, we've only got one way in, one way out. Not ideal, really. Locked as well. Come on. There we go. Probably shouldn't be speeding it up. Oh, no way. Another machete. Couple baseball bats. Ah, oh, this place is honestly something else. This is incredible. I've got an open front door, which is a little bit scary. M14, bunch of shotgun shells. Get that bad boy locked. Okay, this is the last thing I was expecting to find in this place. Oh, I might have to hang about, you know. You might have to hang about in March Ridge for a little bit. Could be a perfect opportunity to get some gun skill on the go. So we've got an easy way out if need be. This is almost like the perfect fallback point as well. Oh, it's just that little bit too tempting, isn't it? A little bit too tempting. That's not what I want to do. Yeah, I know there are a couple. Come check out my newfound spear skill. 
Okay, I thought it was better. It will do. Alright, moment of truth. Can we get her open? Hey, nice. Easy breezy. No bookshelf. Bookshelves are quite rare down here, actually. Margarine. Never say no to that. Calorie galore. Not that we need the calories right now, but yeah, always good to have a, a decent supply. Come on, game. Pull through. I need this. <laughs> Tons of food in the bar from everywhere. Spiked bat, nice. How are we looking for long blunt? Quite good. Very good, actually. I got two more houses. Wonder how much more ammo we can get. I wonder how this corner's looking. Be worth checking out before we get too comfortable. Empty. Guess we did a decent job at luring them away. Hey, nice. It's always good when it opens. First try. So I think I might spend the night in here as well. Probably be worth taking. All right, come on, game. I suppose you can only hope so hard. Either way, though, this place is ridiculous. Couldn't have asked for a better find here, actually. Yeah, more just pure power, <laughs> to put it lightly. Get on our belt, it's basically brand new. Yeah, we'll spend the night here as well. So I'll probably uh, skip till tomorrow morning. I'll see you guys then. Alright, we're up at the crack of dawn, 7am. Let's have some, have some brekkie, clear up some space. So that's the only downside to keeping all the food, is it weighs you down so much, it's pretty nuts. Try to get the hammer in there, yeah there we go, beautiful. Almost underway. So I think I've probably just got to break off this spear and then we'll be golden. We've got one, two more houses to do, there's one further down that way wasn't there. Got to break the window for which sucks, but Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Just so right now. Another hand axe. Wood axe as well. Ooh. Another Molotov. That'll probably come in handy actually. Soon too, I reckon. Well, that's worth a shot. Yeah, either way, we've got a hell of a find down there. Not bad, not bad. Let's mark it on the map. I believe it's this block here. Survivors. 
block. Yeah, pretty gnarly. Stupid amount of weapons. Still need to get here. So the main goal, still that community center. Now that we've got through all of this. And there's, yeah, there's not, not too hopeful I'll find one down in the end house, but we'll give it a go. Yeah, we're, we're here, it'd be rude not to. Where were you? Just one house. Yeah, normally we've got to break a window too. So it's probably not going to be the last of the Zeds. Okay, you're open. You're not. Maybe it was you. There's usually a bookshelf there, isn't there? How annoying. Have a quick snack at least. Oh, what we're saying, these two bookshelves, they're going to have it, aren't they? They're absolutely going to have it. So much hope. Crushed. Well, if we ever need a fallback and a stupid amount of weapons, this is the place that we're going to be. Absolutely. Without a doubt. So it may not have been as much of a generator mag success as I wanted, but definitely, definitely a gold mine. Coming super handy. I was also thinking that maybe now that we've cleared out the bottom end, we swing back behind that fence line, it could actually be fairly safe. Definitely wishful thinking, but I feel like there's a bit of a, a bit of knowledge to that madness. You know, the whole going back the way you came kind of deal. Let's keep moving. There's quite a few extra Zeds down here, which is, yeah, never a good sign. But it does mean we can peacefully work on our spear skill, which I'm all for. I love building up weapons. Nice. Yeah, getting a bit of a uh, bit of deja vu doing this. Gonna try and not speed anything up as well, because I think that's what's causing causing the crashing. They're just sort of pulling up so much, getting a bit too condensed that is not healthy for my computer. Yeah, there's only so much this game can run before it feels like it's gonna explode. <laughs> Yeah, bit of a bit of method to the madness, I think. Might actually be worth ripping something up so we've got a rag to make that Molotov. You can have the rest back. I'm gonna need my shirt back. 16.5. Doesn't put us too far overweight. That's all good. Nothing a bag of chips can't solve. Probably better off leaving that behind. Should have traded it out for a working one.
I hear so many, but I'm assuming it's all of those guys. Well, hoping. <laughs> Last one is to be bombarded down there. But yeah, there's a comment telling me not to come down the west side of this place. Uh, two days ago? Yeah, that, that comment aged very well. <laughs> the left, west side of this town is ridiculous. But it's also the side that I'm used to, so I feel most comfortable. Which again, is a huge problem of this game. So it might not be safe, but if you've done it once before and somewhat trust it, you're going to do it every time, even if it's not safe one bit. Almost like heading straight to the strip in West Point. Do it every single time, even though it's the worst, absolute worst idea possible. I just can't help myself. I'm awful. Uh, how's that looking? Good enough. Try and just sort of jump between for a bit. Could be a good idea going down the other side. we give that a go just before they will come piling out of that tower block yeah not too many down there either again before they start herding For the road. Gotta be just a kitchen knife, isn't it? Yeah. Nothing too crazy. Wow, that's a lot of Zeds. That is a room that I do want to avoid. <laughs> Probably for my life, actually. Let's get a move on. Didn't realise how big this tower block was. Ah man, that's not good. I mean right now it's not too bad, but it's also not good. Okay, you know what, this could be manageable. If I can get a little bit of distance between what weapon have I got in the bag? Is it an axe? Yeah, we've got a big axe. Good bit of crowd control coming right up. Easy does it. This could be manageable. Tell you what, let's let's get the map up quick. We're here. Could be rough getting to this housing estate. Yeah, it's not a bad idea. That's straight shot down. I believe that's it there. This could be a much bigger housing estate than I thought. Almost like a flat. 
Yeah, it looks more like a flat. So it's definitely not a community centre, is it? Could be. Could well be. Oh no, no it's not. It looks more like a flat. It's definitely residential. Come on fellas, bring it in. Let's make this quick. Good lads. Ah, oh, damn it. Is that a nightstick? Fair enough. It's one solid officer. Ah, it's more Zeds than I want. Oh, those vitamins. Gonna be a game changer at some point. Whether it's now or later, it'll definitely come in handy. Come on, fellas. Then it'll come at once. <laughs> nice. Bound to be a few more behind this tree. You don't count. This could also be the community centre. That would be so nice if I knew whether there's a fence here or not. Oh, I don't know. Could also be this place. And I'll sort of come miles off. Oh yeah, this is the tower block, isn't it? Yeah, so I'm over here. Okay, got my bearings. I'm currently here. We need to get down here. Let's see what's diddling. Ah, a lot of Zeds is what's diddling. Hell of a lot of Zeds. If I can get a working car down there. Might have to be a bit of a power Molotov play. It's definitely going to be a broken machete play in a minute, I'm telling you. Don't know where you came from, but I'm glad you wandered off into nowhere. It's going to be one hell of a group. Might have to speed it up slightly. May not be a bad idea at all. Yeah, you know what. Let's go speedy speedy. Let's get it. Slight change of plan. Do you see him too? That's our golden ticket. To put it, put it lightly. So that is our way through this crowd and into community centre. All in one katana. First things first, we've got to make it to it. Doesn't help that we're slightly exhausted. So much for a time lapse, eh? <laughs> Where's he gone? Ah, there he is, I see him. Just along the fence line. If I wait for them to come to me, it should be a little less exhausting. Ah, damn it. Maybe I should have waited just a little bit further back. Yeah, definitely should have. <laughs> oh, crap. Crap, crap, crap. Keep heading this way, I think. Easy does it. Stay down. Nice, nice, nice. Where are 
a friend. He's moved a mile. It's almost worth swinging around this way now. Yeah, the migration on this has definitely been updated, and I'm all for it. It's pretty, pretty brutal, though. So it can make a perfectly safe place into a hellhole, and it's amazing. I love it. It's so active. It's getting riskier and riskier the further around I get, I think. Ideally, I wouldn't be exhausted in this situation. But, yeah, sometimes you don't have a choice. I know for a fact, if I rest, he's going to end up like the Rosewood mystery katana lady that just disappeared overnight. Yeah, that's something that I could live without. If I can sit a lot. Oh, we got a big axe in there as well. Axe man is coming into town. Not in the best shape, but also not in the worst. Another axe. So I don't think this has got much life left, no. Nice. Slightly better shape. Where are you, Katana boy? I'm honestly just holding on for this guy to just come strolling through the woodwork. Wherever he's gone. Oh, he's back on the side we started on. Man, just can't win, can you? Guess we're just going to have to tear through this group, I think. I might speed her up. Feels like a good idea. Yeah, if we even make it. <laughs> Get flanked as well. I swear these Zeds are smarter than Raptors these days. There goes the old machete. Out comes this bad boy. I should really be breaking off the weapons I've got, but. Can't be a new weapon. Alright, time to swing back around the other side now. Man, never ending, I swear. Okay, we dragged a hell of a lot more than I wanted. Come on, then, fellas. Cannot wait. It's going alright to be fair. 16,000. Can't wait to hit level 5. So it's going to be like a dream come true. Exhaustion's just going to be no longer an issue. And I'm ready for it. <laughs> ah, come on. We're just going to have to work our way through them all. Pretty choiceless here. So 
I think the only choice I have is either one group or two. And one group sounds a hell of a lot nicer. It's got that little bit of a nicer ring to it. Come on. Oh man. Okay, you are not going to play ball today, are you? Yeah, really not. It's had about four hits and then. Get out of there. Get out of there. Uh, getting scary. It's the exhaustion. That's what's doing it for me. Throwing me off so much. All right. Where are you, friend? I need him need him gone before I lose him. That's the problem. So I'd love to go home, rest up and sort it out when we can, but we're not gonna have that that option. Tell you what, let's get a time lapse on. We're going to have to pull back, even just a little bit. So it's getting a little bit too risky now. We're up to high exertion, which is, yeah, completely different ball game. It's being exerted is fine, but yeah, high is just something else. As you can see, a whole new ball game. Tiredness will more than likely be soon to follow. Come on. There we go. Alright, can we see him? He's still going to be about. I think I just need to drop back, get my back to the fence maybe. Give myself a full... Sort of just one direction um, approach point, I guess. Yeah, I knew it was about somewhere. Glad you showed your face when you did, my boy. Alright. Let's chill here. I think I might call it a day as well. I think I'm going to push for that katana right at the start of the next one. But for now, I'm going to love you and leave you right here. So, thanks for watching. Massive thanks to the members supporting the channel. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed. Hopefully, stick around for the next one. Peace.